hello guys and welcome to a new brand video today into this trail i'm going to show you how to protect your master branch on github so the first thing to do is to open your web browser either if it was google chrome mozilla firefox microsoft edge or any web browser that you are using after that you will need to go to github.com and now we will need to create an account so we can be able to use the github services so basically all we need to do is to click on sign up and then it will redirect us to the sign up page and now you will need to add your email uh, then gmail.com or any other email that you are using you click on continue you create a password so if it, either if it was anything like that you click on continue and then you will add a username for example whatever the username was now you will need uh, just to type yes or no if you want uh, to have the emails uh, and announcements so click on no if you don't want to and then you will need just to solve uh, as a verification you solve this puzzle so we start this puzzle and the tickle object we do like this and then you will do like that and then you will create an account so basically after you create an account all you need to do is uh, to verify your email by having uh, copying the, co uh, the code that will be sent to your email and then you will just paste it here and you will be able to create a new account on github after that it will sign in you and you will have access to use the github repository and basically now all you need to do is to follow these simple steps so after you go to your uh, account you need to go and access your repository here we will find our branch and settings so basically we are interested in the settings down we will find branch and here we will add branch protection rule so we click on it and here you will need to uh, the branch name add your branch name and here we will add your protection uh, your protection rule so this protection protection for example you will add your rules etc that you want and then you will create so basically now uh, we have just created the protection rule and now we need to add a branch to these rules so basically and basically all we need to do is to add our name of the branch here which is the master branch you just uh, add the name of the master branch here and it will be applied to it so basically after you add all uh as we said before all the rules that you want you need just to save the changes and as you can see currently applies to one branch so basically this is how you can do it thank you for watching and see you next time